When men govern, time stood still. When men govern, destiny sang a new song. When men gathered, the nations took notice. Praise the Lord. I want to tell you people for so God. That our God is so gracious.
We
wanataka wakikuyu kwa nyumba
Yesterday, but one we were in Matemo. And today, na leo, we are in Sogomo. Hapa Sogomo. Praise the Lord. Bwana Yesu and it is now time to hear from the Lord. Na sasa wakati wa kusiki, wa kusikia kutoka kwa Mola. And therefore, I urge all of you. Na pia na ni, 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 ni Wherever you are, ulipo, now be ready to listen from the Lord. Yes, you have, we have worshipped, we have praised, shifu, but this is the most crucial part of it all. Hili ndilo tabo la yote. Praise the Lord. Bwana yesu so turn to your neighbor and tell them, don't move. Yako na siende. Tell them, don't move. Yako na siende. Because they are, are already them that have joined us. Kwa and all of them in Sogomo wherever you are na kila wa Sogomo, kila ulipo, even them that are in their businesses ata wale walio katika zao, them that are passing by ata wale pita, please open your ears na yako, and listen to the Lord na kutoka kwa Mungu. 
Because when you meet with Jesus, kwa sababu unapokutana na Yesu, everything has to change. Kila kitu lazima kibadilike. Praise the Lord. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Including our titles. Acha zile zile title ambazo tunabeba. Majina yetu yanabadilika. Ah, our names have to change. Kuna mtu katika Biblia, there was somebody in the Bible, ambaye walikutana na Mungu, who met with God na jina lake likabadilika and his name got to change anaitwa yakobo and his name is jacob na nakuhakikishia siku ya leo and i want to assure you today nakapokutana na yesu when you will meet with jesus maisha yako yanabadilika your life is changing haijalishi unachopitia it does not matter what you are going through haijalishi shinda zinazokukumba it does not matter your troubles matatizo yote yeye ndiye anayetatua all your problems jesus can solve them bwana asifiwe praise the name of the lord bwana asifiwe sogomo praise the name of the Lord Sogomo. Kwa hivyo fungulieni Bwana moyo wenu. I ask you to open your doors unto Jesus. Yesu ana haja na moyo wenu. Jesus has an urge to come and, 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 and save your life. Praise the Lord. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Jesus is interested in your heart. Yesu, Yesu anataka moyo wako. Praise the Lord. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. So wherever we are, popote ulipo, all the missionaries wa Bwana missionary wote. Praise the Lord. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. As we welcome the man of the Lord Come and speak to us. There is something Joshua and his men did. And even today we are going to use that criteria. We are going to release a sound. Praise the Lord. I am going to shout one. I never had anyone one to the same to upo tayari mahali hapa the of the Lord is here. na kwa hivyo chochote tunabaki kufanya ni kufungua moyo wetu tu and the things that we are only supposed to do is to open our hearts hivyo anaye nena siku ya leo na aweza tukaribia the one who is coming to speak to us today ili tuweze kusikiza kutoka kwa Bwana so that we can hear from the Lord haleluya amen tutakabidhia Bwana hapa na tutakabidhia karibu haleluya haleluya praise the Lord haleluya na tuombe in the name of Jesus Baba katika jina la Yesu we commit your servant before you tunamleta mnanadi wa siku hii wa siku hii mbele yako you anoint his voice tunakuomba uweze kumuelekeza you seem as a vessel mtumie kama chombo let your word come with its power wacha neno lako likuje na nguvu zake that it is going even to convict us ya kuwa litaweza kutubadilisha to judge us litaweza kutubadilisha and even to teach us na pia kutufunza may you say tunakuomba siku ya leo utaokoa may your presence be with us uwepo wako uwe nasi these people are waiting to see your power hawa watu wanagoja kuona nguvu zako may you show up tunakuomba uweze kujionyesha in the name of jesus we pray katika jina la yesu tunaomba tumshangilia bwana sote kwa makofi mazuri habari yetu wote salama habari yetu wote salama bwana yesu asifiwe amina Yeah, it's another opportunity. Na wakati mwingine tena. So we really bless the Lord for coming bana kwa kutuleta sisi tena hapa. He has returned us back to the land of Sokoma. Tuleta tena mahali pa Sokoma. This is 2024. Hii ni mwaka 2024. And this is our first mission to this land. Hapa ni missionary wetu wa kwanza katika And this year na mwaka huu it is my desire nitamaniyo langu and it is also my pleasure na pia nitamaniyo la moyo wangu that we see this land be transformed ya kwamba tukaone ardhi hii kibadilishwe so this land ya kwamba ardhi hii it will not remain the way it is haitabaki vile vile the evil ile wadui that have been there ambao umekuwa pale the things that the enemy has been using yale mambo ambayo adui ambayo amekuwa akifanya to terrorize even our fellow brothers and sisters ili kubadilisha hata wale ndugu zetu na as we come this day tunapokuja As we speak about restoration, that God is going to restore this land. That God is going to restore the lives of His people. That God is going to restore everything that was taken away. Praise God. So I just want you to give me some minutes. 
of your time wherever you are you may be there in your shop you may be there in your butchery you may be there even in your hotel just pay attention for the few minutes that the Lord has given us that you may hear his voice that you may encourage each other that you may be able to uplift those who have been put down praise God praise God again I have a praise song here that I want the praise and worship to come and help me even as we begin that you are not just coming here to dance but you are coming for the mission so praise and worship wherever you are you can join me Hallelujah. We are entering the city. Taking by force. 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 We are entering the city. Taking by force, 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 we are entering the city. Taking by force. 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 Na tuna ukanyaka Bwana Yesu asifiwe Amina Let me do a sambo mm -hmm. Na uchawi wote tuna ushika hivi tuna uweka chini tuna ukanyaka Bwana Yesu asifiwe tuna sishika hivi tuna siweka chini tuna sikanyaka Bwana Yesu asifiwe Amina Are we ready Yes Are we ready Tuko tayari Na hivi yote tunafanya aje tuna tuna ushika hivi tuna uweka chini na tuna kanyaga Bwana we are entering the city. Taking by force, 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 we
Yesu asifiwe. asifiwe. So just be attentive. To the word of God. As we share, na as we begin, na, na just pray that God will be able to reach out to you. In that place that you've been standing, the Lord is able to elevate you. The Lord is able to restore you. The Lord is able to heal you. Maybe you've been sick for a long time. You've gone from one hospital to another. Today we've come. Let's make you to tell you that you are from one hospital to another. Today we've come. Let's make you to tell you that you are from one hospital to another. Jesus is able to heal. Jesus is able to restore. Jesus is able. Jesus is able to bring back your health. Open for me the book of Joel. Joel chapter two. Joel Joel chapter two. Joel Joel chapter two. Joel Joel chapter two from verse twenty-five. Joel Joel chapter two from verse twenty-five. says and i will restore to you the ears that the locust has eaten the congo worm and the caterpillar and the palm worm my great army which i send among you and you shall eat in plenty and be satisfied and praise the name of the lord your God and have dealt wondrously with you and my people shall never be ashamed Praise God. The Bible is telling us that the Lord is going to restore to us the ears that the swarming locusts the locusts have been able to eat. Maybe it is your health. Maybe it is your business. You have stayed in that particular kiosk for many years but you have never made any progress. Whatever that comes in it just goes. Whatever that comes in it cannot stay. But I have come to tell you today that the Lord has promised us that He is going to restore to us, that He is going to establish with the army of Christ. We have been sent to this land to come and tell you that God is going to restore. Praise God! Praise God! The Lord is able to restore as long as you put your trust in Him. The reason to why you may be stagnating. It is because you don't know who you are. How to earn money? Today you are in the church. Tomorrow you are in the witch But Praise God. You cannot make an expectation that your problem will be solved. Some try to solve problem for their own. Some of them have drunk alcohol. So that they can be free of stress. But I can tell you one thing. That alcohol will just help you with yeah. that stress for a moment that actually arise again you go back your health is going your health is not being maintained it to be. but it is going slowly by slowly you reach that point you develop sicknesses but I saw you feel well praise God Christ is the only solution all our problems we taught us when you go to hell they obtain information from you you can imagine you tell somebody whatever that you are going to and he comes now to manipulate your mind that he has a problem his intention is to eat whatever that you have that he can leave you to be in living poverty one day he tried to examine even the life of those which doctors doctors try to look at your life how do they live how can you be able, you are a poor and you are going to another poor man you are now the one who is enriching you, you continue struggling with your pain praise God people of Sogomo listen to the word of the Lord the Lord is the one who is the solution giver praise God you may be there you want just to satisfy the desires of your flesh you do everything so that you can get money. You do everything so that you can be able to be blessed in the eyes of men. But I want to tell you, the Bible tells us, 
there is a time and a season yeah, for everything. There is a time that you will now be judged over everything. Kuna wakati ambao utahukumiwa kwa kitu. Kila ambacho umefanya. All wickedness. Kile uofu wote. There is a day that will be unveiled. Kuna siku itafunuliwa. The day of judgment. Siku ya hukumu. And it is better. Na ni heri. It is better. Ni heri. Yes we are here today. Hiyo tuko hapa leo. Tomorrow we may not be there. Sasa tunaweza kosa kwa. Lord has sent us in this season. Tuko tuma mahali hapa. Come and share. Utude kule ukusudi and encourage you. Kuja tukutie mbele. Come and tell you that. Kuja tukwambie kwa. He is the solution to that. Yeye ndiye mpaya na sio problem that you have. Kila sida ambayo uko nayo. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Bwana asifiwe. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amina. Some of us we can only start not flourish. Familia yetu asiye ndio. The foundation that we laid up on tuliaweka. When we began, tulipoanza they are now demanding sasa sasa hizi hitaji tena sisi tuende kwa ajili ya ya kitu hiki to be satisfied ili wao wakatosoleshe to be able ili wao wakaweze receive even the reward tokea okay, hata zawadi zao want to tell you lakini nataka kuambia the lord is so gracious that he cannot leave you to perish in the book of ezekiel kwa kitabu cha ezekiel let us go in the book of ezekiel Tells us in the book of Ezekiel chapter 33 Ezekiel kuanzia mstari wa 11 kuanzia mstari wa 11 Say unto them waambie Say unto them waambie As I live kama mimi nimeishiwa Jesus Lord asema bwana Mungu I have no pleasure sikufurahi in the death of the wicked kufa kwake mtu mwovu but that the wicked bali turn from his way ayiri mtu mwovu and live na kuiacha njia yake turn you Gairi gairi turn you gairi gairi from your evil ways kaiacha njia yenu mbaya so why will you die bwana mnataka kufa oh house of sodomo e, nyumba ya, ya sodomo praise god bwana sifiwe the bible is telling us Bina that chambia kwa it is not a will of the lord for you to suffer and it does not shida. take any place wala hapa apati raha bwana yesu asifiwe amina it does not please you to perish in that darkness wala hapati katika huku kiangata it is not please to you to die tulikuwa lakini bwana katurejesha and he for this season to fight kwa ajili ya majira haya that we may come ili kwamba tukaweze kuja and also help you hata tukusaidie pia come and don't know him kuja ukamjua yeye and also help you kukusaidia wewe to know that it does not take him any pleasure ujue kwamba yeye afurahishwi for you to die wewe kufa praise god bwana sifiwe praise god bwana sifiwe even you are on pastor hata mtungaji wako mwenyewe pleasure in you perishing wala haisi chukua na furaha because maybe the things that you've been doing labda kile ambacho kiko kifanye may reach at a point and even get a man anasanga may reach at a point and even get annoyed with you anasafika mahali atakasiriki he may reach at a point and even cast you away from the church anasafika mahali atakufukuza kanisa may reach at a point and even to seek about you anasafika mahali atakusahau here we have the good lakini hapa tuko na habari njema our lord jesus christ Wait to Jesus Christ is not pleased with us. Wala afurahishi na sisi. Dying in sin. Kufa katika dhambi. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. So it is upon you. Kwa hivyo ni kwa ajili yako. The decision that you have to make. Ni ufanye maamuzi. It is you to choose. Wewe utakue. Whether to die in sin ili ufe kwa dhambi or you turn away from the sin kwa badili yake na utoke katika ile dhambi yako ni kuishi praise the lord bwana sifiwe praise the lord bwana sifiwe i want to tell you people of god ndio watu wa sogoma na god is so gracious kwa mungu wetu ni mtu wa ni mungu wa neema and that's why from the beginning ndio maana kati pa pale mwanzo when god created adam and eve wale pomumba adam na hawa the time when adam and eve committed sin wakati adam na hawa walipofanya dhambi at first they were too close but they were too close karibu sana na yule mumba at the moment they committed sin lakini wakati tu walipofanya dhambi there was a vacuum that was ulikuwa na utangazo ambao ulikuwa kati yao na Mungu and they could not be able to access na hawaweza kufikia hata Mungu there was a limited between man and God kwa hiyo kati ya mwanadamu na Mungu but God saw it lakini Mungu akaiona vyema to give his only begotten son njia mwana wake wa pekee Jesus Christ Yesu Kristo that he may come ili aweze kuja and take my shame na atukue aibu yangu and take your shame atukue 
Bible yake and be able na aweze to establish you kuwekeza in his righteousness katika uhaki wake praise the lord bwana sifiwe praise the lord bwana sifiwe we have to come back to our sins lazima turudi katika mokombo sio we've lived as prodigal sons tumeishi kama wana wapotevu we've lived as prodigal sons tumeishi kama wana wapotevu we want just to hear what is good in our ears sikia tu kile kilichotema katika masikio yetu but when the gospel of christ yeah, comes in ya kristo yesu inapokuja some people pretend to be busy watu wanajifanya kwamba wako na shughuli they pretend to be not yeah, well here they fanya kwamba hawasikii but i want to tell you lakini nataka kuambia there is a day that is coming ya kwamba kuna siku inakuja you will be able to be judged ambayo tahukumiwa every action ya kila kitu kila 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 tendo that is done and ambayo umefanya hapa chini ya jua praise the lord bwana sifiwe praise the Lord bwana sifiwe praise the lord bwana sifiwe watu wa sogomo praise the lord bwana sifiwe watu wa sogomo the lord loves you so much bwana anapenda sana he loves you so much anapenda sana and that's why has been this season and he's letting us have that you may come he will to go away to return yes you may look young it's because I can't go over but there is something that the lord has placed in us and the bwana ametuwekeza and the kingdom of god na ufalme wa mungu is not about the age wala si hata uko you may looking at us unaweza tuangalia Dancing for him. Jesus to come say look at us. We need to angle here. Pretty him. To come share here. Look at us. We need to angle here. To come share here. Why? Because we know this. Kwa sababu tunachua siri. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. It is upon us as believers. Ni katika yetu sisi ambao ni waumini. But we may be able to stand out. Ili tukaweze kusimama. But we may not just live our life. Ili si tukuishi maisha yetu ya kawaida. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. To the youth in this region katika vijana hata wa eneo hili weeping youth kwa vijana the lord himself is encouraging bana mwenyewe anatuhimiza in the book of ecclesiastes chapter 2 from verse 1 hata mhubiri 12 kumstari wa kwanza that remember also you are created kumbuke mumba wako in the days of your youth siku za utana wako before the evil day come siku za wovu sikuje when you will say ili ya kwamba utasema i have no pleasure in them kwamba sina furaha ndani yake praise the lord bana sifiwe praise the lord bana sifiwe praise the lord bana as youths in this generation we can carry a kisasi yes, yes you may be the child yes, you may be singing yes, yes you may be doing it and everything that there is something that the lord is expecting from us and that is something that you live your life that is worth my 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 life Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. It is an opportunity that God has given us. Bwana ametupa. And you can imagine. Na unaweza tazama. Sometimes try to sit down. Wakati mwingine tunajaribu kuzua analysis over the elder na tufanye mkaratara. Some of them they regret. Ma watu wengine wana 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 hukumika. Some of them they sit regretting. Watu wengine wanakaa kuhukumika. Why? Kwa nini? because they wasted their time kwa sababu wali pekeza kwa wao bwana yesu asifiwe bwana asifiwe praise the lord bwana asifiwe it is an opportunity for us kwetu sisi as believers kama waumini and especially as young people na sisi ambao ni watu wachanga that we may be able to remember our creator kwa sababu tukamkumbuke mwana wetu in the days of our youth siku zetu za ujana in the days of our youth zetu za ujana because the day is coming kwa sababu the day is coming sisi tunakuja and you can You can also unaweza pia do some analysis unaweza fanya and you to understand that there is a time that there is a for every kuna wakati na majira ya kila kitu there is a time when you are child na wakati ulikuwa mdogo you used to walk with your knees ulikuwa unatembea hata na maboti yako there is a time that you step kuna wakati ukasimama you begin touching things and you begin to kugusa vitu but the moment you knew lakini wakati ulipojua how to walk jinsi ya kutembea on your own kwa kwa wewe mwenyewe you do not need any support how we tag it and that how our future is going to be maana hata huyu mbele wetu ya kuwa future right now kuwa na ule mbele wetu we gonna to face it right in future tutaenda kukabidhiana vikali sana we gonna to face it now tutaenda kukabidhiana vikali sana praise the lord bwana sifiwe praise the lord bwana sifiwe it is an opportunity to us ni fursa kwetu sisi and as we come to talk about restoration kuja kuendana kuhusu restoration we gonna to declare tunaenda kutangaza that god may restore everything Every spirit of stagnation that has been there, bounding people of God behind. Mungu watu wa Mungu nyuma. 
that God may be able to restore them. And he is able to restore. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. In the book of Isaiah. In the book of Isaiah. The Bible says, For Zion's sake, I will not rest. And for Jerusalem's sake, I will not rest. And in the righteousness thereof, go forth as brightness, and the salvation thereof as that man and the Gentiles shall see thy righteousness and all the kings thy glory and thou shalt be called by a new name which the mouth of the Lord shall name thou shalt also be a crown of glory in the hand of the Lord and a royal diadem in the hand of thy God thou shalt no more be damned for seven neither shall thy land anymore be damned desolate but thou shalt be called Hephziba and thy land Beula for the Lord delight in thee and thy land shall be married for as a young man marry a virgin so shall thy sons marry thee and as bridegroom rejoice over the bride so shall thy God rejoice over thee I have said to watch men upon thy walls O Jerusalem we shall never hold their peace day or night you that make mention of the Lord keep not silence and give no rest till he establish until he make Jerusalem a praise in the earth the Lord is telling us that for Zion's sake he will not keep silent and here we are saying that even for Sogomo's sake he will not keep silent for Jerusalem's sake he will not give rest and the righteousness of the Lord is established in this land until every Praise the Lord. Some of us have been forsaken. Some of us have been struggling. Some of us have been crying. Day and night. We have no peace. Day and night. Tears have become even our souls. Praise the Lord. We've been forsaken. Some of us have been forsaken. Some of us we don't even have a say in our home. Some of us we don't have even a say in our own marriage. Because the devil has taken our advantage to bound you and to manipulate your mind and to tell you that you are not able. To tell you that you are finished. But today we've come to tell you that there is a God in heaven. There is a God God in heaven, who is able to restore even that forsaken land, even that forsaken home, even that forsaken marriage, he is able to restore. To restore. Praise the Lord. In your business, I have stagnated there. You are just earning money. You only pay the debts. You get the money, there is nothing that you can be able to do. It is like you are just working for you. Praise the Lord. At the moment you discover that you are a son in Christ, that you have made a son in Christ, you will be able to make more You will be able to make more You will be able to end a good day. Begin a day. Now, what is the Trusting in the Lord. 
that you provide that you will bring the cash that you will be able to establish 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 that you Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe watu wa Sogomo. God is so faithful. Bwana wetu ni mwaminifu sana. He has sent us with a word of restoration. Kwa neno la urejesho. He has sent us with a word of restoration. Kwa neno la urejesho. He has sent us with a word of restoration. Kwa neno la urejesho. You may be wondering. Unaweza kuwa na stress up in your soul. Unaweza kuwa na jiuliza. How shall it be? Sasa itawezekanaje? You are about even to give up. Hata labda wewe tu kwa sababu hiyo moyo. To kill yourself. Hata labda kwa tayari kutafuta because of the difficult situation as we've come with hope but we've come with hope we've come to tell you that it is not over we've come to tell you that there is another chance we've come to tell you that our God is faithful we've come to tell you that in business you can be able to move from that particular position of business and be able to own us more and we're able to own us and be able to own the stores and be able to own and be able to own Praise the Lord. As long as you accept him, he will be able to do that. He will be able to do that. He will be able to give you more He will be able to give you more money. He will be able to increase the number of customers. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The reason to why we struggle. It is because you trust in our own mind. Kwa sababu kama tunategemea akili zetu, we do not put our trust in our Lord. Tuta wake up imani yetu kwa Bwana. We are bribed. Sisi hata tumekuwa hongo. Not even what the way the Lord at all. Tutafanya ile kazi ambayo Bwana anatukusudia. We not work faithfully. Tutafanya kazi kwa uaminifu. The moment you sit yourself apart. Lakini ile wakati tu kitetea sit yourself apart. Tutenge tu from the congregation. Na hata ile kundi. Tell yourself. Na kwa sababu you are not to bribe. Kama mimi sitachukua to be faithful. I'm going to stand. I'm going to be satisfied with what I have. And I'm going to be able to stand. 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 I'm going to be able to in the past, happened early. Not many years from now. Praise the Lord. I was a sinner. Praise the Lord. I used to commit adultery. I used to commit all kinds of sin. Praise the Lord. I was a drunkard. But the Lord saved me. The Lord washed me. So you is a drunkard. You may be wondering how shall it be? Can I be saved? Can I be saved? Accept this Christ. Praise the Lord. It is possible. The moment you put your faith in Him, you will be able to turn around. He will turn around that mountain. He will be able to turn around. That mountain of drunkenness. He will be able to turn around. That mountain of drunkenness. He will be able to turn around. That mountain of drunkenness. He will be able to turn around. That mountain of drunkenness. That you are saying and you are calling it. I'm born on a witness. No, no, so much of this is true. That's just amazing. Here in Atlanta, so it tells you that you don't have to be if I've not tested alcohol, kama si chaon chapombe, I cannot be able to survive. Wala siwezi hata kuishi. It is just like that alcohol has become ni kama you are able. Huo pombe imekuwa tatiganda. Instead of praying, badala ya kuomba, you go to drink. Unaenda kuleo. Instead of even going to church, badala ya kunikani, you go to remove the lock. Unaenda kutoa lock. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. Bwana anatoa lock. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amina. Kuna wale wanatoa lock every morning. Wanatoa lock kila asubuhi. Sasa sijui hii lock nayo ni gani. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amina. We also used to remove those locks. Hata sisi tunatoa hizo lock. Christ came and washed us. Nikuja katoa hizo locks kila roho. He set us free. Akatuweka huru. We are free indeed. Huru kwa kweli. Hallelujah. 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 Stop cheating yourself. Acha kujidanganya. It's a must for you.
to drink. When you to survive. It's a must for you to drink. When you to be active. It's a must for you to drink. It's a must for you to be aggressive. I want to tell you. What you are saying yourself. And the report. The Lord is telling us that. We turn away from God's wickedness. Turn away to Jesus. To refresh our lives. To give us a new beginning. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Restoration to happen. For us to come. To decide. Last more for the Mamus. You must decide. Last more for the Mamus. You must decide. Last more for the Mamus. You must make a step. Last more for the Atua. Of faith. Yaimani. And you reach up a point and get a lot of those things. When you reach up a point and get a lot of those things. When you reach up a point and get a lot of those things. To our sisters, to our daughters, set you. You may be there. You are not alone. You are living. You are not alone. You have reached the point of seeing that there is no help again. You are not alone. 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 Now I'm going to leave you. When I go out, we are going to be in your minds. They are all just the tribute. When the power men are changed, they will come. We are going to be in marriage. We are going to be in children. We are going to be in children crying. We are going to be in the time now. We are going to be in the future. It will be too late. 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 Praise the Lord. Turn unto Jesus. Turn unto Jesus. Before Gabla, the world turns into darkness. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord again. In the book of Ecclesiastes. Chapter 12. The Bible tells us from verse 1. Now, thy creator, in the days of thy youth, while the evil days come, the Lord will give thee rest. Now, thy creator, in the days of thy youth, while the evil days come, the Lord will give thee rest. Now, thy creator, in the days of thy youth, while the evil days come, the Lord will give thee rest. Now, thy creator, in the days of thy youth, while the evil days come, the Lord will give thee rest. Now, thy or the stars not darken. Have you got The clouds return after the rain. Ya kurudi In the days when the keepers of the house ile walinzi wa nyumba shall tremble. Hapo wenye nguvu atachemeka. The strong men shall bow themselves. And the grinders na wasoka ukoma because they are few. Wakuwa ni haba. Those that look out of the window na hao wachunguliao be darken. Na dirishani kutiwa giza. Praise the Lord. But remember also your Creator. Regardless of the pain, there is one thing that you need to know. Just use an example of your parents. There is a time that some of our parents they begin to narrate their pain. There is a time that some of our parents they begin to narrate their pain. There is a time that some of our parents they begin to narrate their pain. There is a time that some of our parents they begin to narrate their pain. There is a time that some of our parents they begin to narrate their pain. There is a time that some of our parents they begin to narrate their pain. There is a time that some of our parents they begin to narrate their pain. There is a time that some of our parents they begin to narrate their pain. It's a time for you to build yourself. It's a time that you can either build yourself or destroy yourself. It's a time for us to seek the face of the Lord. It's a time for us to look for something else. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. We are not there to mix ourselves. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The Bible is telling us that before the light, the sun, Kabla the Sura, as the stars are darkened, Kabla the Tuagiza. This now tells us that there is a time coming, and it is not far. Na how come Bali? It is not far. How come Bali? It is not far. How come Bali? It is just around the corner. Iko hapa tu kona. And that's why the Lord is reminding us. He is calling us to repent. Na kuita katika urejesu na na kutubu. That we may turn away. Ya kama tu kasikeoki. From our wicked ways. Ya kutoka njia zetu na mbuzi zani. This is our season. Hii ndo majira. 2024 ndo imeanza. Hii 2024 imeanza. Praise the Lord. Jana sifiwe. January is over. January mesa. We are now on the first Sunday of February. Sahi tuko jima pili ya kwanza e February. 
I know that some of us may be having many plans. Even concerning our own life. Without recognizing even what the Lord has been able to do for us. I want to tell you. There is a time for everything. There is a season for everything. And we need to utilize every opportunity. Praise the Lord. 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 Yes, you may stay there. Ndiyo unaweza kuko pale from Monday to Sunday. Kutoka Jumatatu hadi Jumapili. You are in that business. Uko katika biashara hiyo. You don't have even time to pray. Hata hana wakati wa kuomba. The moment you go to sleep, ule wakati unaenda kulala, the thing that clicks in your mind, ile kitu kinachoro katika akili yako. They have promised you tomorrow. We will bring the man. Tomorrow comes. They are not around. They change now to go to other people. They want to tell you. There is a secret in Christ. There is a secret in Christ. There is a secret in Christ. That his wealth adds more blessings. And he has no sorrow. You may be struggling because you are dry. On your own power, but we have yet a secret. We are keen to conceive. You discover that you are a child of God. The moment you confess, where we are kept with your mouth, now we are carried to the land of the living. That is the Son of God. That He died. 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 That he is the Son of God. He will be able to turn around. He will be able to turn around. He will be able to turn around. He will be able to change your story. He is the story changer. He changes the story. He can be able to change them to be called the Russians. Ana badilisa kuwaita wazi. It is upon you. Ne kuachili yako. Come back to yourself. Ni suti yako ujasa kwa kuburudu kwa zaan. Kama vile mwana mpote. Some of us. Badi yetu. Yes, we received Christ. Yes, we received Christ. And we reached the point. Ita fika mahali. Stations were hard. Hata kufikoru. We had no wealth. Hatu kuwata na kali. And we decided now. Tutukamua sasa. That we could not now to be with the Christ again. We decided to choose our own ways. Tukamua tukutua. And we are here today. Years have become the food. At a matter of time, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, in the night, in the night, in the night, you cannot sleep. How was it? Because you are great. You are guilty. 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 Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Our good is so faithful. That he cannot take any place. He does not take any place. For you to perish. For you to perish. Praise the Lord. 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 Praise the Ni wakati wako to build your relationship kuchenda uhusiano wako to build your relationship kuchenda uhusiano wako with Christ na Kristo you parent wewe mzazi who is here ambaye yuko hapa it is your chance ni fursa yako to build your relationship kuchenda uhusiano wako with Christ na Kristo some of the parents baadhi ya shida some of the parents baadhi baadhi ya hiyo wazazi Some of the children even wonder what kind of life is this? What kind of family is this? Some of the children have decided not even to marry and not get married. How is it all the situation at home? The uncordiness at home it sends them away away from their home. Some are lost even in immorality because of the foundation that was laid in their family because of the foundation that their forefathers laid praise the Lord praise the Lord praise the Lord one thing that you need to know it is your responsibility and the Lord has given you those children so that you can be able to take care of them so that you can be able to take care of them so that you can be able to take care of them and the moment you neglect the 
moment you neglect, the Lord is going to release wrath. And He will not bother. Now, while at a time, He will consume the entire family. He will consume the entire family. He will take away the entire family. Praise the Lord. Read with me the book of First Samuel. Shoma na mimi kitabu cha Samueli wa kwanza. Chapter three, mlango wa tatu. You will see what happened to the house of El. Tawana kila bacho mlango wa El ifanye kumsasi. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 The book of First Samuel. Kitabu cha Samueli wa kwanza. Chapter three, mlango wa tatu. And it came to pass. Na kaja kupita. Chapter three, verse two. And it came to pass. Ika wakati huo. When Eli was laid down in his place, and his eyes began to wax dim, that we could not see, and and ere the Lamb of God went out of the temple of the Lord, where the ark of God was, and Samuel was laid down to sleep. Samuel alikuwa melala katika hotel la Bwana palipokuwa na sanduku la Mungu. That the Lord called Samuel. Na Bwana akamwacha Samuel. And he answered. Na akasema, Here I am. Mimi hapa. And he ran unto Eli. Akamwendea Eli. And said, Kwa haraka akisema, Here mimi am I hapa. Thou call me. Kwa maana uliniita. And he said, I could I could not I could not. Akasema sikukuita. Lie down again. Kalale tena. And he went and lay down. Naye akaenda kulala. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. Here the Lord is calling Samuel. Bwana hapa anamwacha Samuel to prepare him. Ili achamwandae so that he can be able. Ili akaweze to deliver kupeleka the message. Ili uchumbe to Eli. Kwa Eli. To Eli. Kwa Eli. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. The reason to why the Lord is calling Samuel. Sababu kama Bwana anamwacha Samuel. He to use him. Alikuwa anataka kumtumia. And tell Eli because him being a parent, he failed to own his children. Ali wacha kuokuwa when he was doing abomination upon the altar of the Lord. Ali kuni madaba wya bwa. Praise the Lord. Bwa na sifuwe. Praise the Lord. Bwa na sifuwe. The Lord called Samuel. Bwa na limuza Samuel. Send him. Ili akamtume. What has he been sending here? Ali na kamotume. Praise the Lord. Bwa na sifuwe. Been sent in this land. Come and warn you. Come and remind you. Ili kuja kwa kumbusa tell you. Ili kuja kuambia. The Lord is not your master. Bwana any form of abomination sin a ile of wetu. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Mimi mtu says but. Bila tuambia kwa because the Lord told Eli. Kwa sababu Bwana alimwambia Eli about the wickedness of his children. Sana na wao for to work. And he feel to want them. Na akashinda kwa atadarisha. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. The Lord decided now to bring the wrath. Bwana kaamua tu kuleta hukumu. And the moment na wakati tu the Lord releases the wrath. Bwana alipatilia ghadhabu. It is not easy for you to withhold his hand. Hauwezi kutuliza mkono wake. It is not easy to bring back his hand. Hauwezi kutuliza mkono wake. Time will come. Wakati utafika. The grace period will not be around. Wakati wa neema itakuwa hapo. The time will come. Wakati utafika. He is there even to hear of this. Utafani hata kusikia crusade. The time will not be around. Lakini wakati hautakuwa. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. This is your time. Good work. This is your time. To turn unto the Lord. To come unto Him. To reconcile yourself. To turn unto Him. To Him. Pake. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. There is nothing too hard with our God. Hakuna kitu gumu mbele ya Mungu wetu. He able to change. Ana uwezo wa kubadilisha. He who changed the soul to Paul. Yeye alimbadilisha sauli kuwa Paul. Paul who persecuted the church. Musa ndiye alikuwa anatesa kanisa. Paul who stood against the teaching of the church. Mama kinyume na mafundisho ya Kristo. Paul who was sepo. Ambaye alikuwa na uwezo in the apostles. Hata kuwa hata man who was sepo. Ambaye alikuwa na uwezo. He had to get a bisa mjimsima. But when time came. Lakini wakati ulipofika. But when time came. Wakati ulipofika. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. The man submitted. Bule mtu akajikabidhi. He submitted. Akajikabidhi. Under the authority of Christ. Ya mamlaka ya Kristo. When time comes. Wakati ukifika. This may be your time. Hata unaweza kuwa wakati wako. This may be your time. Hata unaweza kuwa wakati wako. Hata unaweza You reach at a point you don't even understand who you are. Ali hao chelewe ni nani? You begin telling yourself lies. Na kuchambia maisha. That I'm addicted. Ya kama mimi ni ni kwa nini ni kwa nini to do anything. Na siwezi fanya kitu. I'm not be able to do it. Na siwezi fanya kitu bila hiki. I want to tell you today. Na kuambia leo. In Christ. Ya kwamba kwa Kristo everything is possible. Kila kitu kinawezekana. 
praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. 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 The Lord wants us to be restored back to Bwana nataka tuletese tena kwake. It is not taken pleasure. Hawala hawezi furahishwa. The Lord says that. Biblia inatuambia kwamba that the mother can even forsake the child. Hata mtoto anaweza mkana mwanawe. The mother can be able to forsake the child. Mama anaweza kukataa mtoto wake. Who pinned him? Ambaye alimpatia utini. Ha, ambaye alimtuma kwa miezi tisa. But our God can never forsake us. Lakini Mungu wetu hasi kataa. That's why we are here. Ndio maana tuko na root pride. Wala tuna root gusto of any wala tutikana. Come with the truth. Lakini tumekuja na wewe. Our God is able. Mungu wetu anaweza. He is able to restore. Anaweza kutuletea. He is able to heal. Anaweza kutuisha. He is able to return you back. Anaweza kutuletea. Katika Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord again. Bwana sifiwe tena. It is our desire. Nitamanio letu even as missionaries. Hata kama missionaries. Let it be your desire. Hata iwe tamanio la. The Lord will be able to restore you. Bwana ataweza kuretesha. Those struggles. Hata ile sura ya preach. Unaweza kuwa bila fruit in many places. Because your life also lakini maisha yako pia stagnate. Bwana sasa kuna mtu au tu struggle. Unaweza kuwa na unangana. Lord. 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 Sometimes we reach at a point we boast of how great and how mighty we are. Wakati mwingine tunaangalia sisi tunakuwa na the breath that we breathe to us now. Tuna tunaacha kwamba hata ile pumzi ambayo tunapumua. It is the Lord who has given you. Ni Bwana ambaye amekupatia. And he expect you. Na anatasamia that you may praise him. Ya kwamba kamsifu. Even in that business. Hata katika biashara hii may praise him. Ili kamsifu. Even in that kiosk. Hata katika hiyo kiosk. That you may praise him. Ili kamka. Even in that sifa hotel. Hata katika hiyo hotel may praise him. Ukam ukampatia sifa. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Haleluya. Haleluya. It is a such an opportunity. Ni wakati mwingine. In such a system, ni majira mengine. What shall we render unto the Lord? Tutampatia Mungu nini? For us to be able to testify of his goodness. Sisi ambao tumeweza kushuhudia wema wake. We've been able to see him doing it. Tumeweza kuona kifanya katika maisha yetu. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Some of us we do hide, but yet tunajificha. Yes, at home we are believers. Hale nyumbani sisi ni waumini. But when we come here, lakini tukija hapa, because there is no one watching over us. Kwa sababu hakuna ambaye anatuangalia. We just do the things that we like. Tunafanya vile mambo ambayo tunataka. We just do. Tunafanya the things that are good in our own. Yale mambo ambayo ni mema tu kwetu. But when we go home, lakini tukienda nyumbani, we continue pretending. Tunaenda tunaendelea kujifanya. The Lord is going to set you. Bwana ataenda kukuweka. He going to make you be ashamed. Ataweka aibu kwako. That secret life that you are living. Hiyo maisha ya siri ambayo unaishi. The things that you are doing in secret. Yale mambo ambayo unafanya kisirini. Be reminded. Ikumbushwa. There is a time. Kama kuna wakati. This thing is going to be unfair. Mambo haya yatafunuliwa. They going to manifest. Mambo haya yatajidirisha. I don't know where you will hide. Sisi tutajificha wapi? I don't know where you will take your truth to jipeleke wapi? Safe for to mbali pale. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. And from the best it is vice versa. Hapo yetu hata ni hiyo ni mimi. Unaweza kuwa hata at home. Kule nyumbani wewe unataka kutaka mkaeteni ni hiyo. Kwa sababu hapa kuna wewe. Waambona kuna kile compromise. Unaanza kujidirisha call to us. Mwito kwetu. That we be restored. Kama tukaweza kurejesha ile live one life. Kaishi maisha moja. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. The Lord is not expected. He is not interested in us. Sana freshness na sisi. Different parts of life. Na kuishi maisha in our own to do other things. Mkari ama in the past we do other things. Lakini hata kwa sababu ya police leo tunafanya mambo mengi haya. Kwa sababu ya police rahisi. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Tell your neighbor. Ambia jirani yako. Tell your neighbor. Ambia jirani yako. Be yourself. Wewe kuwa wewe. Tell your neighbor. Ambia jirani yako. Be yourself. Wewe kuwa wewe. Tell your neighbor. Ambia jirani yako. Live your life. This is not a yako kariya Christo. Praise the Lord. Bana sifiwe. Tell your neighbor. Ambia jirani yako. Stop hiding. Ata kutificha. Praise the Lord.
the Lord. Bana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bana sifiwe. The word of the Lord is healing to everything. Neno la Mungu linasababisha kila kitu. The word of God is healing to every situation. Neno la Mungu linabonya kila kila hali. The word of God is healing. Neno la Mungu linastore the broken. Ili kurejesha wale waliofunjika. Praise the Lord. Bana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bana sifiwe. It is a call to us. Ni mwito kwetu. It is a call to us. Ni mwito kwetu. That the Lord has said which men upon this land of Sodom. Ya kwamba sisi Bwana wetu tumapa Sodom. They shall not keep quiet. Ambaye atatanyamasa. And he crosses not in the land of Sodom. Mpaka Kristo hapa nani Sodom. Is manifested. Amebirishwa. And the Bible continues to tell us. Biblia tuambia kwamba that give him no rest ya kwamba usimpatie kumsifu those whom the lord has called in this wala ambao watu bwana amewaambia give him no rest wasimpe bwana let us not this be the end acha hii sio mwisho and after we've done with this crusade hata tunamaliza kusini hii the end of us haitakuwa mwisho kwa hiyo you to this people hata kuendelea kuwafikia watu hao he is calling us ya kama partner peter as watchmen kwa linzi as watchmen kwa linzi as watchmen kwa linzi that may watch over ili tukaweze kulinda this city may be established ili mti huu kaweza kuimarishwa praise the lord bwana sifiwe praise the lord bwana sifiwe praise the lord bwana sifiwe it is an opportunity ni fursa ingine yes ndio opportunity ndio fursa and it is a call to us and the winter for us sisi wote ambao tunataka kurejeshwa for restoration to happen kwa ajili ya urejesho kufanyika for restoration to happen kwa ajili ya urejesho kufanyika you must come to christ ni lazima uje kwa kristo you have to come to Christ. Ni lazima uje kwa Kristo. You have to submit to his lordship. He cannot begin with kwanza building a foundation upon another foundation. Unjui ya msingi mwingine. We have to disconnect ourselves from any other foundation. Kila msingi wa it may be even the foundation of our family. Kwa sababu ni msingi wa familia yetu. It may be even the foundation that we ourselves kwa ni msingi wa familia yetu. Tuniweka and we assume them natuna tunaona everything ya kila kitu ya kila tunaona everything ni kila kitu he is calling last kind of tweet leo restoration to happen kwa ajili ya urejesho ufanyike must come ni lazima tumrejeshe yeye bwana yesu asifiwe amina so sogomo to be restored kwa ajili ya sogomo kurejeshwa the land of sogomo must come back to its and ya sogomo lazima ije and the lord has given us power bwana ametupa nguvu over every kingdom kwa ajili ya kila ufalme over every territory juu ya kila ya kila over every principality juu ya kila ngome over every kingdom juu ya kila ufalme the mission of his name kama tukitaja jina la bwana every knee kila goti shall bow litasama every time kila 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 shall confess uta utakiri hallelujah 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 it is a call to us ni wito kwetu we come back to him kama tumrejee Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. 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 Sogomo. It's the time for us to come back to our city. Wakati tuje katika hatima zetu na katika akili zetu. Bwana sifiwe. Bwana sifiwe. Just as the prodigal son. Kama vile tu mwana mpotevu. After he has wasted everything. Baada kama amepoteza kila kitu. He has wasted the resources. Amepoteza mali zake zote. He has wasted the wealth that he was given. Alipoteza mali zake na rasilimali zake. He came back to himself. Alikuja katika akili zake mwenyewe. He discovered. Akagundua that where he came from. Ya kwamba kule alikotoka. There was enough food to eat. Kulikuwa na chakula tele cha kukula. There was enough clothes to wear. Kulikuwa na nguvu, kulikuwa na nguo nyingi za kuvaa. There was honor. Kulikuwa hata na heshima. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. But he make a decision. Na akafanya amusi before he make a decision. Kabla kufanya amusi. Of even standing and going to the kusimama na kurudi kwa baba yake. He decided in his heart. Akaamua moyoni mwake. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Salvation is something that you desire. Wokovu ni kitu ambacho unaamulia. And you can decide to be restored. Unaamua kurejeshwa or you remain stagnated ama ubaki pale pale you may decide unaesamua or choose ama unaesamua 
Aguro. to be elevated Kuinuliwa. or to be removed Ama ukaondolewe. from that wicked foundation pale mahali pa and be built upon the right foundation ukajiwe katika msingi wa Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Christ yes. praise the Lord asifiwe praise the Lord asifiwe it is a privilege na ni fursa that you come to him the way you are. Ya uje vile vile ulivyo. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. He does not select. Wala atagui. He does not choose. Wala abagui. He does not look how we are. Wala adali vile umovu. He does not look how. Adali vile. Immoral you may be. Vile ambavyo umepotoka. He may not even look at how. Adali. Tunangad you are. Kile vile ulevi uluo. Baba mtu just the you are. Tumekuvumilia na vile vile tu ulivyo. He is able to bring you back. Anaweza kukurejesha. He is able to restore. Anaweza kukurejesha. He is able to call you. Anaweza kukuita his son again. Mwanawe tena. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. 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 Just as the prodigal son. Kama vile mwana mpotevu. Many of us we are living the life of the prodigal son. Wengi wetu tunaishi maisha ya mwana mpotevu. We run away from our creator. Tunakimbia nje ya Mungu wetu. Who is the source of each and every day? Ndio mwanzilishi wa kila kitu. We go and try to fix things. Tunaenda kujaribu kutengeneza mambo bisi si wenyewe. But for a short period of time, kwa muda kidogo, we are back in our past. Sisi tumerudi katika umaskini wetu. We wetu whatever that we have. Tupoteza kila kitu ambacho tuko nacho. We have now continued in perfect. Hata tume ndelea katika maskini praise the lord bwana sifiwe praise the lord bwana sifiwe praise the lord bwana sifiwe it is a call to us ni wito kwetu sisi as people of sogoma kama watu wa sogoma it is a call to us ni wito kwetu sisi that we come back to our city kama turudi katika akili zetu that we come back to our city turudi katika akili zetu that we come back to kama turudi our sins are like a famous said the struggle that you are going to live on and about it here some of them have decided had yet to make to make to make to make fun of my mouse but it's just a few way one as a few way she doesn't get it and you're not pretty yeah Leo mwenye ulitupeleka ulio toa kwako that thing that you brought through was set to kwa mganga ukatipeleka kwa mganga ukagangika and you are, you, you do some umerudi na umerudi uliona kutafuta suluhu aha lakini umerudi na shira zako ndio Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amina. But when Christ takes us free, Christ akitu, akikweka huyu, yeah. akikupa pumziko, akikupa pumziko, bila yeah. akikurejeshea, ndio, utajiri wako. Aha. Hautarudi huko ukilia, ndio. Bali utarudi ukifurahi. Amina. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. In that particular marriage, katika hata ndoa hiyo, wewe hata unakata tamaa. Mm. You are about even to run away from your children. Dogo tu wakimbilia watoto wako. You are about even to run away from your husband. Kimbilia hata mama wako. You are about even to run away from your husband. Dogo tu wakimbilia hata kwa mke wako. Because of the situation kwa sababu ya ile hali that you are going through ambayo unapitia. But you've come to tell you. Lakini tumekuja kuambia leo that in Christ ya kwamba katika Kristo there is fullness of joy. Na hotel wa furaha. In Christ ya Kristo there is fullness of joy. Na hotel wa furaha. Christ ya Kristo there is fullness of joy. Na hotel wa furaha. There is restoration Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Just calls upon our decision that we made. Inahitaji tu maamuzi ambayo sisi tunafanya. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Ndio mtu said that the Lord has said before us. Ile anasema kwamba ametuwekea kifo na na na, na usima. And it is now our choice. Na ni sisi maamuzi yetu. To choose life and live. Tuchague maisha tuishi or choose death and die. Tuishi tuchague kifo na tufe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. He is able to take away the shame. Anaweza kuondoa taifa. He is able to take away the pain. Anaweza kuondoa maumivu. He is able to heal you. Anaweza kuponya that condition that you are having. Ni hali ambayo uko nayo. We have Christ who na Christ so who is able. Ambaye anaweza. There is something that you call restoration. Kuna kitu ambacho kinaitwa rejection. Naitwa rejection. Naitwa rejection. And when it, uh, the time is right, na hata wakati ukifika, you will make it happen. Atafanya kitendeke. When the time is right, wakati wa sawa ukifika, you make you to arise. Atafanya when the time is right, wakati wa sawa ukifika, you make you to be established. Atafanya imarishe. When the time is right, wakati wa sawa ukifika, you be able to release blessing. Atajilia baraka. Hallelujah. 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 Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. You may have given up. Unaweza kuwa kama ni mtu mzima. Hata maisha ni hapa. Back at home maybe. Huko nyumbani 
When you look at the condition, when you look at how the parents are, it cannot even encourage you to go back. It cannot even motivate you to go and even stay together with them. But today the Lord is saying, I'm going to restore for us. Praise the Lord. We're going to restore for us. The years that the Swami Locust the Lord is able to eat. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Come on and you're in Pugium Corn. Come on and you're in Pugium Corn. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The Lord is able to restore. Yes, Bumana Wesa Kurchesa. But he cannot restore. Lakin Hawes Kurchesa. If you are still continuing on that particular lane, Kama Badon and Elia Katika Island, Chile, you have to divert. The last mouth talking. Praise the Lord. You have to divert. You have to divert. Because the moment you continue, you're going to fall into the pit. And there is no one who will be there to help you. To even lift you up. To even lift you up. Praise the Lord. Amen. 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 But you will die there. You will die like a beast. You will die like a beast. But the moment you come back to him, you will come back to him. He is able to restore. Ana uwezo kurejesha. He is able to restore. Ana uwezo kurejesha. He is able to restore. Ana uwezo kurejesha. Praise the Lord. Bwana sifiwe. 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 Praise the Lord. The Lord is able to make you even move from that particular hill. He gave you a supermarket. The moment you put your trust in Him, He is able to establish. Praise the Lord. In the book of Proverbs, chapter 3. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Proverbs chapter 3. In your own eyes. Fear the Lord. And depart from it. Praise the Lord. The Bible is telling us that. Trust in the Lord. With all your heart. If you are in Christ. When in Christ. You are like me in Christ. Whether it is in the witches. Whether it is like me in Christ. And the Lord is so divided. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Time for us to live. What life? We have to live. 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 Of profit, he like it to agree with you. He will be able to establish. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He will be able to put your trust in him. He is awake. He is awake. Praise the Lord. The moment you close your eyes, the enemy opened his eyes. Praise the Lord. He comes now to do everything that he wants. He just wants you now to continue remaining there. But because you don't have knowledge, even about the business, you need to Unaitaji kutu 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 k
Praise the Lord. You need to be the prophet of yourself. You declare every principle, every power, every spirit of darkness that I continue just to be there. You declare that I have the strong. Praise the Lord. Our God is able. The moment you put your trust in Him, praise the Lord. And you know, sometimes as we grow, we reach at a point and we begin now to pay ourselves. That is where we go wrong. You remember the time when you were a child? You used to trust in your parents in everything. You could work with your parents. When your friend comes in, he wants to beat you. You run to your parents. Because you trust in your son. And you know he will protect you. But as we grow, we see that we are able to begin working with our children. At late and slow, we forget about God. Because even those parents who are our first protector, Praise the Lord. We need to tell ourselves we need to be careful. We need to be careful. We need to be careful. We need to to be that the life that we are having. It is the Lord who has given us. Some people just imagine that the moment you sleep, it is a master to awake. But the moment you close your eyes, it is the Lord who has given us. It is a master to awake. 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 It is a do not leave him on your own. Yeah. We see him in your way. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. We need to run unto the Lord. The last one we used to run to our parents. Our elder brothers. But the moment the enemy comes, we run to where they are. Because we know that they will protect us. Praise the Lord. And you can imagine right now. When I say, 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 when I say. Your parent who used to protect you. Your elder brother who used to protect you. Praise the Lord. You are now you've now remained on the scene. You are alone. But our God is so faithful. But our God is so faithful. You are not alone. But you are not alone. 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 Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. We need to put our trust in the Lord. Let's not wake up to my knee. Let's wake up to the point and be like children. Fika mahali to go wana. Baba, we can be able. Amato na weza to go to our parents. Wenda kwa sasa siwezi to explain everything. To look at na everything that happened. So you are clear. Kita baje kina kwa sababu we are able to tell you. We are able to tell you. Because you know. Kwa sababu we have a solution. Baba kuna suluhu. But right now, we've reached a point where things are eating us. We are struggling with the reality, but we are there just to keep things silent. We are just struggling with the reality, but we are there just to relax. Praise the Lord. This is the season that the Lord has sent us to use. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, people of Sodom. We need to reach the point, brethren. 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 But you will be able to glorify Him. Lakini tu tewe zako mtu kusa yeye. In everything that we do. Katika kila kitu tu tunafacho fa. In everything that we do. Katika kila chochote tu tunafacho fa. In everything that changes around our life. Katika kila kitu tu kina badilika katika maisha yetu. Praise the Lord. Bana sifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bana sifiwe. For restoration to happen. Ba jili ora Jesus kufanyika. We have to come back to our senses. Lasma tu rudi efa muzetu. And we need to be like children. Nani lasma tu e kama wana. We need to be like children. Tu e kama wana. Kama watoto. 
Because if you can be able to place yourself in that image, the time that you are young, the things that you used to do, they are contrary against to the things that you are doing. Why? Why? Because you've justified yourself. Because you've seen yourself. To be able in everything. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. It is an opportunity. It is an opportunity. For us as the children of God. That you may come back to him. For he is able to restore. He is able to restore. There is nothing too hard for him. You may be there even addicted to, to, to bang. You may be there you are addicted even to alcohol. You may be there even addicted to mira. That you cannot be able to do without it. You've made those drugs to be your cause that you worship them every morning that you worship them every evening that you cannot sleep without praise the Lord forgetting about how your health is being disappointed some of the decisions that have been developed it is because of the things that you are doing against some praise the Lord Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. It is a call to us. To awake from sleep. To awake from ignorance. And be able to align ourselves. To the will of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord again. It is a call to us. Praise the Lord. It is a call to us. And the Lord is telling us that He's not interested in us perishing. He's not interested in us perishing. He's not interested in us dying like beasts. Dying in shame. Praise the Lord. Why shall we continue? Terrorizing even the generation that are coming behind us. And we need to know that the things that you are doing right now it is like you keeping something in the bank for the sake of your children. It is better we awake. It is better we arise. It is better we stand up and come back to Christ. It is better we come back. And submit unto him. And submit unto him. And submit unto his Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Salvation is free. We don't ask you to give you one of us is a good patia pesa yote for you to receive Christ. You put a kupukupokea Christo. Salvation is free. We're covering Bure. And the Bible tells us that the moment you confess with your mouth, Wakati Toki, Kiri Karam Domawako, and you believe in your heart, now a mini moyoni mwako, that Christ is a good Christian. And that he died, Yakoma Likufa, and he rose, Naka Fufuka. And he is seated at the right hand of the Father. That you will be one of the sons of God. One of the sons of God. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Many streets that you are struggling with. Some of them doctors have said that it is the end. We cannot be able to go beyond this. The grace period. Just wait for you to die. But the moment you come in Christ, the moment you recognize that he loves you, you will be able to tell to yourself that I will also live. That I will also live. That I will not die. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. 
even as we are nearing to the conclusion kama vile tunavyokaribia kukuhitimisha nataka tu i want just to encourage you the people of sogom nataka kuhimiza watu wa sogom that our god is so faithful kama mungu wetu ni mwaminifu sana it has why he sent his son dio maana akatuma mwanawe yesu kristo You can imagine you having that only begotten son. Unaweza fikiria tu kuwa na mwana wa pekee. In human nature that only son that you have. Ya kwa wanadamu ile huyo ni mwana pekee uko naye. Whom you call your favorite. Ambaye unamuita tu mpenzi. Whom you call your dear son. Ambaye unamuita mwanao mpendwa. There are time comes. Lakini wakati unafika. For you to give him out. Wewe kumpeana. That he may die for the sake of somebody else. Ili aweze kufa kwa ajili ya mtu mwingine. It is not possible. Haiwezekani. But with our God it was possible. But with our God it was possible. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. In the book of Galatians, kitabu cha Galatia. chapter 5 from verse 18 but if you be led lakini mkiongozwa of the spirit na roho you are not under the law hapo chini ya sheria now the works of the flesh basi matendo ya mwili are manifest ni dhahiri which are this you hire adultery washerati fornication uchafu and cleanliness uchafu Deceiviousness, disadi, idolatry, ibada ya sanamu, witchcraft, uchawi, hatred, wadui, variance, ugomvi, emulation, wivu, wrath, hasira, strife, fitina, sedition, baraka, heresies, uzushi, anything, chusuda, madaras, ulevi, drunkenness, ulevi, revelings, ulafi and such like na mambo yafanana na hayo of they which i tell you kati ya hayo nawaambia before mapema as i have also told you kama nilivyokuisha kuambia in time past ya kwamba the day which do such things watu watendao mambo kama hayo shall not inherit hawatauriti the kingdom of god ufalme wa mungu praise the lord bwana asifiwe the lord is telling us that ya tuambia kwamba if you walk by the flesh tukitembea katika mwili We gonna to satisfy, to satisfy the desires of the flesh. And the results of it, hata ile matokeo, we will be preparing our way to hell. Tukatoa chanda kwa ajili ya njia yetu kuelekea jahanamu. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. But this is the time, lakini hii ndio wakati. The Lord is calling us. Kama Bwana na Twitter. That you may be able to repent. Ya kwamba ukaweze kutubu. We may be able to kaweze kutubu. We return back to him. Urejeshwa pake. That you may live every form of wickedness. Ili tukaache kila aina ya uovu. Every sins that we've been able to justify. Kila dhambi ambayo tumeiweka haki. That you may put them aside. Ili tukaweze kusieka kando. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. I'll just ask the missionaries to draw nigh. Ita surutisha tu wa wa missionaries wakuje karibu. Even those who are in verandas, those who are wherever you are, you can. Hali people those who are in the verandas, wala mbogo kule kwenye verandas. Just want to remain. Some people can remain there and proclaim. Watu kidogo tu wazima kipasa. And others we can be able to scatter. Lakini sisi wengi tunazatawanyika. We want to make a declaration to our fellow Tanzanians of Jia Ardi. That God is going to restore. Ma Mungu atakurejesha. That this soil, ya kwamba ardhi hii, it will not remain barren. Mchanga huu hautabaki. That this soil, mchanga huu, it will not remain the way it is from one generation to another. Hivi hivi kutoka kizazi kingine. God will be able to restore. God will be able to restore. The mighty name of Jesus. Alika jina kula Yesu. The mighty name of Jesus. Alika jina kula Yesu. I want you to sing for me. Nataka mniimbie. Abudi bwana. Tukuka bwana. Tishimi kabwana. Tukuka milele. Wewe ni Mungu hakuna kama wewe. 
Hakuna
Dan Passo Mercedes. Ela guarda na mão cruz, sua mãe saiu virada. Mas o dela, por essa boca vale, Baby Dancer, por essa boca liga pro carrinho. Baby Dancer, de trapeço, né? Só que ele já passou. And the word of this gospel, the word of God, when it comes, it is like when the rain falls upon the land, it does not go back empty, it does not go back empty, but it establishes that which the Lord has for his people. Whatever you are, you can just raise your hands. Don't fear. Don't fear. Don't fear. Don't fear. The moment you fear in the eyes of the Lord, the moment you be ashamed for the sake of Christ, He will also deny you, even in the presence of His Father, where you are, just believe in your heart, and repeat these words before me. Say, Lord Jesus, I come before you. I accept myself as a sinner. Today, I confess my sins and I pray that you may help me. Rub my name from the book of death and write my name in the book of life. Lord Jesus, release your Holy Spirit to minister upon my heart, to minister upon my heart that I may be able to live. Change the direction of my life and every sin that I've committed. Father, forgive me. I confess today that you are the Son of God. You died on the cross. You are buried. And on, that, on the third day, you rest from the dead. Thank you, Jesus, for saving me. Let us make this prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Lord, I thank you for your children. Those who have accepted you, my Father, this evening, I pray for them much of the universe. But Lord, may you help them. Give them the strength, my Father. The decision that they have made, give of peace. Some have made it, my Father, keep down from their heart to of peace. I pray that Jesus, may you help them, my Father. But Lord, may you be there. Father, connect them with a Bible believing child. Connect them to the issues of Asia. Since it is not all about us, my Father, it is all about you, King of Kings. We give them unto thee, my Father. We give them to the King of Kings. Restore them, my Father, to your will and purpose as much as the universe. For the rich man like my father. Blessed be thy name. I want to pray with these people. You may have lost hope even in life. You may have struggled even with certain things in life. But today the word is telling us that the Lord is going to restore us. That God is going to restore us. That God is ready to welcome us as his children. That God is ready to welcome us as his children. He is able and he is ready. To return even us to the place that he wants us to. You may have walked even to the witch doctors. Umetembea katika njia zote umejaribu kwa madaktari wote wa ulimwengu. Ndio. You've not been able to manage. Haujaweza kuweza. You still have the same condition. Bado uko na ile hali. You still have the same problem. Bado uko vile vile. Today I want to pray with you. Leo nataka kuomba na wewe. The one thing I pray from you. Kitu moja nataka kuomba tu. Put your trust in the Lord. Weka tamani yote to to trust us. Usituamini sisi. But trust in the Lord. Lakini muamini Bwana. Fix your eyes unto Jesus. Mwezo yako kwa Kristo Yesu. Who is the restorer of each and every. Who is the finisher of our faith. Who is able to restore us back. We just believe wherever you are as we pray. Father in the name of Jesus. 
I pray for my fellow youth road in this land. I know my fellow, we have those who have been addicted to the We have those who have been addicted, oh God, even to sexual immorality. We have those who have been addicted, oh God, to all kinds of sin. But my father used to say to me, I was a sinner, my father. I was a drunkard, I was immoral, my father. The moment I accepted you, I never regretted what I said. I pray for them, my father. I the grace that to put upon my life, the grace that has sustained me, part of this being in the fifth year, since I received you, oh God, I've never, Lord, turned back. I've never, my father, regretted I pray for them, Jesus. My father, every plan of the enemy, every attempt of the enemy, I give their life, give of grace. Father, may you take it away. 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 The pardon, Jesus. That your children may be walking with him, oh God. Day and night, my father. And Lord, we pray that Jesus, may you give them rest, my father. May you give them rest, my father. Wherever they are, master of the universe, even those who are under the voice, Lord, my father, we pray that Jesus, establish yourself, oh God. Establish them, my father. Establish them, Jesus. Even those who may be hardening their heart, Father, I pray. Yes, now, they are of That they shall be able Lord, to recognize you. They shall be able, my Father. They shall be able for you, Master of the universe. They shall be able, oh God. To confess you, my Father. They shall be able, Master of the universe. To do their relationship with you. I pray for the businessmen and women, Lord. In this land of Sokoba. But my Father, you call it to establish them. You call it to establish Jesus. You are from my Father. And Father, stay to their business. Every heart of the enemy, oh God. Every hand of the enemy. That is not just the way they are resources. That is not just the way they are profit. I will pray this day, oh God. That you call it to take it away. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray even for students of God. As we commence, my father, with our academics, Lord, just as you saw my father, to gain knowledge, master of the universe, in our different careers, my father, I pray that Jesus, you will give us the focus, you will help us, my father, that you will not do anything that will go against my father what we are supposed to do King of Kings every spirit of failure every spirit of failure every spirit of failure you are the chain breaker my father there is power in your name oh God break every chain break every chain my father and restore your people and I just work. Restore your people, my friend. May they rejoice, Master of the universe. May they sing of thy goodness. And above all, my father. Take all the glory. Thank you, Jesus, even because of the mission. Thank you because of each and every one. Even my father, sweet continue. Advancing, Lord, into thy kingdom. We pray for your grace, O God. We pray for your favor. That you may continue establishing us. You will continue, my father, giving us even more grace, oh God. Grace even among the stars, my father. The watchmen, oh God, who will watch over this city. They will not wait and hear, Lord, a certain sister, my father. For us to come, King of Kings, but we shall be able to lift our eyes. We shall be able, my Father, to lift our eyes. Even for the sake of Sogoma, for the sake of this rich and master of the universe, for you are worthy and your faithful. We praise my Father. We worship master of the universe. For all that you've done, my Father. Lord, we give back all the glory for the souls that you've saved. We give back all the glory for everything that you've done. 
Father, we return back all the glory. We decrease Jesus that you may increase. We disappear, my Father, that you may appear in the heart of your people. Let you be and to us, all God. But let you be and the master of the universe. For the glory and the honor of your name. We bless you and your exalt. In Jesus' name, I do believe and pray. Amen. 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 Barikiwa <laughs> na leo tumemalizia hapa Sogoma na kwamba ule urejesho ambao kwamba tulikuwa tunatarajia kwamba Mungu ataachilia katika miji ile ambayo tumetembelea na kwamba Mungu ametimiza neno lake siku na leo hivyo twende pende za Mungu tukamshukuru ni Taala na atenda katika miji hiyo ambayo tumetembelea hata yale ambayo ameatenda katika miji hiyo wa Sogoma kwamba tunakutukuza tunakupa sifa maana hakika unastahili tunasema ni asante ni kaoma wako Mungu atabii zako katika maisha yetu Bwana umekuwa mwema umekuwa mwaminifu sababu tunacha kukupa Tukisema 